All right, what's going on, y'all? Back on the poor pods again. Uh, I'm about to give y'all a little pro tip. Like I said, I don't know where I got it from. Um, get you some cheap Luma foil. That, you know, get you some cheap Luma foil because I wasted a whole lot of material right there. I was sitting there trying to fill it. I was trying to fill in the hole, and I was like, "Oh shit! Let me go grab some little fall and fill that hole." And I said, "I could have used, I could have used all that material to finish up." Like I said, I ran out. I thought court would be enough. It should have been enough. I could have used that shit to fill in all the gaps over there. So get you like little four, and I ran out a little four and everything, because I wasn't thinking. Cause I wasn't gonna do this today. Uh, get you some little foil. I don't know if you can see up in here. Okay. And you can use that, or you can get some wooden. Like I said, you can use that if you get it, get it real, real tight. You can use that to raise your piece up. And say you uh, on some MDF. And you know, since I never. Took all, never took all the uh, tape off. Yeah, you can come back with your uh, Dremel and trim it up. Cut up, trim it up. He's trimming up, and that's it right now. I said, I'm not going to take it off yet because I still need to fill in, this, fill in these pieces. I need to fill in these pieces. And probably what I'm doing is I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get some. Uh, I'll probably end up getting some silicone or some R RTV and come in from behind and, and fill up, you know, fill in the gaps. Or I might just go ahead and do some spray foam. Uh, so I got a can of spray foam and just do a, a quick coat. I need to recoat. So I need to recoat my. Uh, Sit in the house anyway, so I need to fill in my gaps anyway at the house. So, um, like I said, this shit right here is good. I ain't buying no product besides the glaze. I will buy this shit right there. Same, like I said, good shit. But get you a gallon of this shit, or like I said, you probably need. Between, I went to, I went to, like I said, you probably can get by one can per door, one quart per door. Not a quart. Yeah. It's two pounds, uh, I think that's a quart, no? Almost a quart, half, almost a quart. Get you like three of these or get you a gallon. I recommend getting you a gallon because I'm going to check see how much it is online. Get you a gallon, but me, I'm just gonna ahead and get get another quote to finish up this, and then after curtain up, then I then when I, cause this right here, this is my winter, this is my winter project. So I get done with it, I get done with it. If I don't, I don't. So um, that's all I got for this update. So um. You, when I take this tape, pop this off, you're going to know what I'm talking about. Got got the screws in there and everything. Because when I take the nut off, when I take the nut off, I should be good to go. And you really don't need that much fiberglass and resin because I got a, I got a uh, cold over there. So, when some motherfucker stole the hardener on that bitch... Took the hardener out that motherfucker. I didn't notice it. Good thing I had some hardness and hardener. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and get off here, man. It's about time for me to start cooking. And I'll catch y'all next time.